class is in session. The professor is in. It is time for some extra credit with Apollo Creed. So if you want some bonus points, it's time to use some bonus attributes. And in this case, it is one of the new skill plates that has been added to the game. It's the rising up skill plate. Whenever you break three or more yellow gems, gain three black move points. Now let's go check out the build. Uh, I do not have a take down two of this variety. So this is gonna do um, 170 or so percentage, so less than 200, so we are losing 30% right here. And then not having the take down two as well, so we're missing another 40%, so we're actually missing about 70% less black move damage, and there's more to come with that, but I just wanted to give you a sense of how much damage we can do so far. So we are going to put on, uh, similar to last time, this is going to be our main move right here. This is the heavy right hook. That's going to do um, over 2 million damage with all the bonus and the trainers that I have. But there are ways to increase that to closer to 3 million. So keep that in mind that this move alone will hit about 3 mil uh, each turn. Uh, and I just don't have the ability to show that much. Uh, but this move right here with the plate will allow us to get an extra turn or more of using that uh of this move. So in terms of trainers, um, in feud, and if you're going against somebody with black MP, you don't need an MP trainer. So we're going to put as much black moves in the trainers as you can. Um, if you, uh, most will not have, uh, obviously Rocky this high. So what you could do is put EO sky in here and she will do a hundred percent. So we're missing another 50%. So in reality, um, we are missing 120, uh, or so percentage of black move damage. So let's go check out exactly what he can do. We'll take it on against uh, the Undertaker. So there's Apollo Creed doing his dance. So in Feud, this is only a 2 MP charge, so it'll be ready to go. Right now, even without all of the black move damage, we're going to do 2 million on each turn. So we're going to do this, steal his uh, MP. So if this was doing about 3 million a turn, so we can say that's 3. We're going to hit it again, steal 2 more MP. That's 6. That's 8. This would be, sorry, 3, 6, 9, that would be 12. And then we can hit one more right here. Um, so we hit that five times. So even without all that extra stuff, you can see that he has gone from 14 million down to just about uh, 3 million damage right here. And that's without all the best uh, trainers uh, and otherwise. So now what you can do, um, if you still needed to, is you can do one of two things, right? So you can hit this three by two and just put it in a place that's not going to cascade. And by breaking the three yellows, you're going to increase your black MP, or you can try to be gutsy, depending on how much health your opponent has, and try to make a five match without cascading. So let's try to do that here. We did not cascade. That triggers our plate. We hit it one more time, and he's basically out of life. If they had more life, you would then look for a black or a yellow uh, hit, so that way you could reload that one more time, which we just did. So we've hit this seven times. Seven times, roughly 3 million damage. So we can all do the math. You're going to do 21 million damage if they have black MP um, uh, to start with in the match. Then at that point, you could uh, hit whatever move does more damage for you, basically, uh, to end the match, right? So this match is all done. So as you can see, this is going to absolutely destroy uh, anyone pretty quickly, pretty easily, especially when you max them all out. So what happens then if you go up against somebody who doesn't have a black move? Well, I'll show you. So with the plate, again, break three yellow, make uh, black moves. So what we're going to do this time around um, is we're going to hit this move right here. So with a black MP trainer, instead of one of our move damage trainers, we would hit that black move first, then we would hit this move to create yellows, and we're going to try to do this without cascading, so fingers crossed. 
And we did. So then it would load up this move again. We would hit it. We would then have a free swipe to play with. So we'll take that swipe. And then we would hit this again. So we were able to hit it three times. And with full metals and everything, that would be about 9 million in damage. And then you can go on to destroy uh, and make a big, big boom right here. So let's destroy some things. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll make a big boom. Of which he's able to kick out, and then we'll win the match. So you can see how effective that might be overall. So you'll be able to do a ton of damage on on turn one, again, provided you don't cascade. Uh, but you can see that when fully maxed out, it's easy to do at least 9 million damage uh, on turn one. So there you have it. There is Apollo Creed Rocky IV, the extra credit version. If you have yourself the rising up plate, you can see just how much damage he can do. Roughly 21 million uh, against Black MP uh, Superstar Posters. Let me know what you think in the comments. As always, like, subscribe, and share. Professor and class is done.